Congress may be projecting Rahul as its future, but Sonia has clarified that for the present, none else but Dr. Manmohan Singh will be the party's prime ministerial candidate. She says, we look forward to his continued leadership and his inspiration, particularly to the younger generation. Sonia is aware that Dr. Singh's second bypass has started off speculation that he may be reluctant to persist with the top job in case the UPA comes back to power. Hence the need to reiterate how indispensable the Prime Minister is. I am saying that the Congress campaign will be led by the Congress President and for the post of Prime Minister, Dr. Manmohan Singh is our Prime Minister. There is no vacancy today. Aware that many in the party nurture Prime Ministerial ambitions, Sonia realizes that it's safer and best to make this clarification. This is also important to keep the fragile unity of the party together. Within the party, there has been a turnaround. From being labelled a reluctant politician and hence his limited role as a major campaigner for the party, Dr. Singh's personal stock has risen, tempting Sonia to suggest that he should contest a Lok Sabha seat. Sources say she feels that this time round he can make it. Search for a safe seat is on. It all depends on the final tally. If allies do well, then Manmohan Singh will be the only acceptable choice. But if the Congress improves its tally, then voices in Rahul's favour will get shriller. With Sumit Pandey in Nagpur, in New Delhi, Pallavi Ghosh.